Hey everyone, happy Valentine's Day weekend. Valentine's Day is a holiday that is wrapped up in so much, right? There's this idea of romance and significant others and dates and flowers and, and all these things that can actually um, bring up a lot of stuff for many of us, right? Uh, and so something I'd like to share regarding this holiday here in Mexico, it's known as Dia de la Amistad or Day of Friendship. And I think that's such a beautiful way of looking at this holiday. Um, and of course, there's the, there's the romantic side to it as well. But I love this idea of day of friendship and honoring all relationships that have um, the energy of love in them. Um, it could be with your pet, with your best friend, with your family, with your significant other, if you have one. And so it opens up this idea that, um, you know, the energy of love should be celebrated and should penetrate all relationships, not just um, the romantic ones. And I really love that. And the meditation we'll practice together today, this short meta meditation is rooted in Buddhist tradition. It's been practiced for centuries and it's all about sending uh, loving kindness and everything that has to do with the energy of love, first and foremost to ourselves, because it has to start here. And then you know, slowly going out, 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 out until we encompass all beings. And so uh, I'm really excited to share this with you. It's one of my favorite meditations to practice. It's just so, um, I don't know, it always, it always arrives in the heart, I feel like, for me at least. So uh, here we go. Find your seat for meditation, sitting on a chair like I am, on the floor, on a meditation cushion. Whatever your seat for meditation is, go ahead and take it. And take a moment to look around the room that you're in, the space that you're in, take in uh, what's around you just to orient yourself so that you find your seat, but then you also just allow yourself to really realize where you are, which for me brings a sense of soothing right before the meditation. And then you'll bring your gaze back to the space in front of you. Go ahead and close your eyes and cultivate this sense of an energetic line that moves through you from the cosmos, the universe, drop that line through the center of your skull all the way down the whole center of you out the center of the pelvis. And imagine that line drops down into the earth. So that sitting up straight, I say it all the time, is not about being rigid or holding a proper seat. It's about really living on this energetic line that moves through you. So plugging down to lifting up and lifting up to plug down. Then bring your awareness to the space of your heart right at the center of your chest as you deepen your breath. And as you allow a few rounds of breath to come in for yourself as you settle and really arrive here, start to contemplate what sensations you associate or what feelings you associate with loving kindness. So love and all things that are derived from love. Maybe it's a sense of lightness, of levity, a warm sensation. Maybe it feels like a big hug or a gentle smile, whatever this quality is for you. Let it land in the space of your heart. Perhaps even giving this quality or this sensation a color. Maybe imagining a gem, a jewel, swirling light, swirling energy at the center of the chest in a certain color so that you have an imaginative anchor for this practice of metta or loving kindness. And as you breathe into the center of your heart, bring yourself into your heart space. So bringing your awareness to yourself as you are on this day, at this time, with everything that has brought you here in the past and all your dreams and visions of your future, bringing yourself 
And sometimes the most difficult act of loving kindness and sending yourself this loving kindness so that you may be happy, free, at peace, and graced by the energy of love. So holding yourself in your heart, take a big deep breath into the heart space and exhale, send yourself loving kindness. Two more like that, inhale, bringing your awareness to yourself, to your heart space and exhale, wrapping yourself in loving kindness. Inhaling fully, this visual of the energy of love at the chest and then exhale, wrap yourself in the energy of love. And now bringing into your heart space, someone that you love unconditionally, someone that you would leap across an ocean for, someone that knows you like the back of their hand and you know them like the back of your hand, someone that you just love <laughs> so much. Bringing this person into the sphere of your heart that energy, that color, that sensation, breathing this person into the space of your heart and sending them loving kindness so that they may be happy, they may be free, at peace, and graced by the energy of love. Inhaling into the space of your heart and exhale, sending this person loving kindness. Imagine that you're wrapping this person with loving kindness. Inhale into the space of your heart, the potency, the power of your ability to love and exhale, no matter how far away this person is, imagining you could wrap them in this energy of love and kindness. One more breath, inhale, breathing into your heart and exhaling, sending this person that you love dearly Metta, loving kindness. And now bringing into the sphere of your heart and perhaps the most courageous act of loving kindness, someone that you have had issues with, that you've had friction with, that uh, maybe you need to forgive, someone that you have a challenging relationship with. You bring this difficult person into the space of your heart, inviting them in so that they too may be happy free, at peace, and graced by the energy of love. Inhaling into your heart and exhaling, wrapping this person in loving kindness. Inhaling into the space of your heart, your courageous, powerful heart, and exhaling, wrapping this person in loving kindness. Inhale, metta into your heart and exhale as you wrap this person with loving kindness. And now for the very last act of loving kindness, bringing all beings everywhere, the totality of this universe, the totality of the unknown, all beings everywhere 
into the space of your heart and sending all beings everywhere loving kindness so that all beings may be happy, free, at peace, and graced by the energy of love. Inhaling into the heart and exhaling, imagining from the center of yourself, you expand this energy of loving kindness as far as you can imagine. Wrapping all beings everywhere in loving kindness. Big breath into the heart, like you're charging the battery of the heart and then exhale, sends this energy out as far as your imagination can reach. And take one more here, inhale. Exhale, sending loving kindness out to all beings everywhere. As you take your hands to your heart, either Anjali Mudra, prayer position, or palm on heart, other hand on top of that hand. I'll leave you with this mantra, simple, inhale, I am, exhale, love, inhale, I am, exhale, love. And if you have time, you can stay and repeat this mantra, say five to 10 more times. If you don't have uh, more time for meditation, um, we can say namaste here. Otherwise, allow yourself to sit and stew and ruminate and envelop yourself in loving kindness. Inhale, I am, and exhale, love. Namaste.